Anyway, folks, you know, Ghana, we don't take too much attention to our health, you know. I mean, it will be a dear girl, you know. We joke everything, you know. Everyone say, I'm not saying, I'm not the other gems by cry gems in the cool, no? you know, like, <laughs> even the one who discovered gems is killed by gems, you know. So we say things like this, you know. So we don't really pay detailed attention to our health, but health does matter. That is why it is my pleasure to introduce this lady, Gladys Ufusudazi, who has established an NGO called Health Matters. Healthy, yeah. Put your hands together, show some love for Gladys. Here we go. There, there, there. Great. Welcome to the studio. Thank you. And have a seat. Wonderful. Welcome. Thank We're going to take a commercial break. And when we come back, health matters. Stick around. We'll be right back. Don't move. Don't blink. Don't breathe. The KSM Show will be right back. Well, we're back. We're back. And I told you in the house that we have Gladys, the Pussy, a Dadzi in the house, who has an NGO called Health Matters. It's, it's, like I said in the beginning, you know, sometimes Ghana, we, we play with our health small, you know, we, yeah. Uh, no, do you know why? Has it, have you done any studies into why our attitude to health is so um, yeah, not? Because, yeah, we think health is expensive, you know. Really? Is yeah. it a money matter? It's a money matter mm. because in Ghana, there's this cash and carry system, so people really don't want yeah. to take, um, we all notice about their health. Mm, yeah, mm. so they wake up, go to work, stressful day, and they think that's a normal duty. Yeah. But then you have to take care of your health. Too. Mm. Yeah. And when they have a headache, they'll take para and then yeah, self -medication. go and buy their own medication. And yes. Yeah. <laughs> so Health Matters is an NGO, yes. and that, that wants to introduce, not introduce, but sort of help educate Ghanaians on Health Matters? Yes. That you started? Yes. First of all, tell me um, how you came about with the idea, then we can ask a little bit about the NGO. Okay. Um, it was one day when I was going to work. I was in a car, and then um, there was nurse, this. Right? Yes, I'm a nurse. Okay. I work at airport clinic. Okay. Kotoka International Airport, yeah. Okay. And then there was this man in the car who was giving, let's say, like Rongapo. <laughs> and everybody seems to be interested. Really? Yes. What, what was he talking about? He was talking about this um, medication that when men take the antihypertensives, they become impotent and that they can't perform. And how he was saying it, he was really saying the wrong thing. Wow. Even though sometimes we have some side effects yeah. which affect males, but then how he was putting it, it was <laughs> very uncalled for. <laughs> so when I was in the car, then I was like, why is it that he, he doesn't know, but then he's trying yeah, to... Yeah, talking authoritatively, yes, like he knew. and he was convincing them. So I was like, no, mm. I think the little knowledge I have, I have to start something. I have to start educating the public. Mm. Yeah, so that they will know that health really matters. And then there are certain basic informations that you can get, which you'll be in the comfort of your home, get some messages, and then you read. Because WhatsApp, a lot of things are roaming on WhatsApp. Yeah. Yeah. We get time to read and share. So why don't I create a page? Mm which I'll start with my friends, then send daily health and wellness tips. So um, the name just came, Your Health Matters. Okay. And okay. since I'm starting it in Ghana, I made it Your Health Matters Ghana. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. So it's active on social media? Yes. Really? Yes. On what, so what do you do every morning? You send a health message? Yes. Every morning I send the health and wellness tips on health conditions, medical conditions, personal hygiene, General health, basic health and wellness tips. Mm. Yes. So. And if, if somebody has a specific question, can they fire back? Or? Yes. Um, the page is made up of stakeholders, like health professionals, mm -hmm. and then some general people. Mm. And then when you put a question there, there are doctors on the platform, oh, nurses. Really? So the moment you put any question there, there will be a doctor or a nurse to respond, respond instantly. Yes. So what, how, how do we get to the page? The page is called what again? Your Health Matters Ghana. Your Health Matters Ghana. Yes. And that's on? It's Fa on Facebook. Facebook. And then we have our website where you can just go there and read health information there. Okay. And then okay. the WhatsApp platform. That's yes. very exciting. So the page is called Your Health Matters, Matters Ghana, Ghana. Yes. where you can simply go and, and discuss health issues. You can throw a question if you have, sure. throw it out there, and you get somebody to respond. That's right. 
eventually almost immediately um eventually what? sometimes the data will be off okay so when all when we put on the data then they will the send the responses will come. yes okay but because we have other health professionals on the page sometimes i'm the administrator i don't need to answer because there are other health mm -hmm. professionals mm -hmm. there so by the time i get the the message the question is already answered okay okay yes. okay currently i have five pages on the WhatsApp, and each one is taking about 256 now. So I'm having about 500 people on WhatsApp. Wow. And then 4,900 people following me on Facebook. Fantastic. Yeah. That's, that's really, uh, should I say, a stroke of genius, you know, because yeah. we are all going so digital, everything is social media, yeah. and that's a great avenue to decide to reach people. Yes. Wow. Yes. So folks, uh, this, is, this is really good. Ghana, Health, Health Matters Ghana. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so it's more all questions on health issues yes. and things like that. Yes, fantastic. And because um, WhatsApp platforms, people just paste every, anything there. Yeah. With that page, it's strictly health information. Okay. So you can't just post page, um, pictures. Yeah. And then jokes, Bible yeah. quotations. No. Yeah. yeah. It's strictly health. So okay. anytime the person gets a prompt, the person will know that it's something about health. Okay. Okay. Yes, yes. And uh, are, the, are the people who are using that platform, do they strict, uh, stick to health issues or they sway yes. into... Yes, it's strictly health, so they, they stick to it. And then if you don't conform to it, you automatically be removed. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. Great. Great. Mm. That's fantastic. And um, I mean, I think it's a great idea, yeah. you know, in this digital age that we live in, to have a platform like that that can reach people digitally. Yeah. And um, hopefully your presence here will, will get the information to more people and more yeah. people will sign on. Um, well, thank you very much. And I think that um, I'm, I'm, I'm very impressed with this because you. you're a nurse and any nurse can decide I'm going to work and when I finish, I'll go home. That's right. You know, I'm doing what is required of me. But you haven't. Yeah. You have decided to take advantage of social media yeah. to push health matters on social media and open it up yeah. for people who may need help. You have done well. Thank you. Okay, thank you too. Thank and you. thanks for coming, joining us. All right. Stick around, folks. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your swagalicious sugar daddy will be right back. The KSM Show.